Hello everyone, and welcome back to another video. This time we're in the garage, testing a 2001 Hunter Original. This fan I got about last November, and I haven't tested it yet, so here, after owning it almost a year, we're going to be finally showing it on video. So this fan I got off Facebook Marketplace for $100. It was brand new in the box, and it's in relatively good shape. It's got some paint scuffs on it but functionally it's all there so anyway I don't really have anything else to say so I'll start by turning the fan on low oh let's, let's video the fan now that that sound you just heard was the garage light just turning off on its own. So low speed is pretty good. Pretty classy low speed. Here comes the medium. Now this fan does make a tiny bit of hum if you're right next to the blades, which are the part that resonate, but if you're just any distance from it, it's pretty much silent. So a medium here is going about as fast as any modern uh, China fan would on high. And it's moving plenty of air. Alright, let's go to high. High speed is very powerful and it actually feels really good because it's humid and I'm sweating a lot so it's nice to get some airflow. I'm gonna stand back here so you can see the whole fan in one shot. Turn it off now. And do spin down. And if you're wondering, no, I will not be testing this with five blades. There are plenty of other videos on YouTube that you can see a five blade original. And the blades on this are actually not the original blades. These blades come off of a Hunter Studio series. And they've been scuffed up and used a little bit. So they're not in the best of condition. Especially on the wood side. But they work just fine for this test. Alright. Now, as far as oiling goes, I put a little bit of oil in this. But it's not running for very long. So I, it's not something I have to worry about. All right, here's reverse low. You're gonna go through the speeds a little bit faster on this one. Here's medium. It's a little unnerving when that thing torques like that, but that's just how these things are. And then, Here's reverse high, medium low off, and then back to forward. Now we might as well sit through spin down again. Now if spin down seems a little bit uh, fast. Again, this is a brand new fan that's been sitting in the box for 20 years. So, and this is the first time I've had it running, so the bearings are stiff, and it's not completely oiled, but it's oiled enough to the point. I will put about maybe a quarter of the tube in there just to keep it from being completely dry, but it's, it's fine for what I'm using here.
All right, so that's reverse. Now I have this uh, switch here, and it's we're gonna turn it to medium for one last thing. Turn it here, and you can see help it get started because it is a little bit underpowered on this because this uh, control isn't really meant for this size of fan, but you can see they get a really nice low speed out of this. So that's kind of nice. There you can see the vents on the top. I always like those vents. So that's the fan. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And I'll let it spin down one more time because why not? All right, so that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thanks for watching, and bye for now.